Hey, what's up, LW gang? I am here today. I am actually making some lasagna rolls. I'm just cutting up the green peppers. I'm doing the lasagna rolls totally different. I'm not going to make it like a regular lasagna. I'm going to roll it up. Roll it up. <laughs> I'm going to roll it up because, you know, that's the new thing that people are doing today. I made it before and it was very easy. So, what I'm doing is of course y'all know how i do on the weekend sometimes it's friday sometimes it's saturday i cook a meal for families or for the homeless and i give it to them so today that is what i'm doing i'm prepping lasagna for special people today they're gonna love this so i'm just have everything already lined up as you see over here this is the lineup of all the stuff that I'm going to use in the ingredients. I got red peppers, yellow peppers, green peppers, and also onions. And this is going to go into the pan. <clears throat> and I'm going to saute everything up before I put the ground turkey in it. Yes, I use a ground turkey. <laughs> and now that I have everything chopped up, I have the red onion peppers, all the peppers cut up right here. Also, I did the cheese earlier, so I mixed everything in here. Sharp, mild, gouda, um, mozzarella, all the Parmesan cheese, all of that in here. I turned the stove on. And then I use olive oil. This is what we're using. And I'm gonna saute the peppers and everything. And then I'm gonna add in my ground turkey. Okay, now that I got the pot a little hot, I'm going to add in my onions not a lot of them just some of them some red peppers yellow peppers and some green onions and I'm definitely going to use the rest of this for something else I'm just saute them up So now I'm taking my ground turkey and combining it with the rest of everything, the green peppers, onions, and everything. Oh man, it's gonna be delicious, All right? That's how I do that. Then while that's cooking, I'm just gonna in the meantime, flatten this down just a little bit and add all my seasonings in the pot. That's right, why it's in there, why not? You can add any seasons you want, but I'm doing adobo, garlic, kosher salt, onion powder, and also some oregano. There we have it. Then I'm just gonna do one of these numbers. Get everything all cooked up together. This is what it's looking like so far. So while the turkey is still cooking, I'm gonna take my noodles and add them why not and they'll be done pretty much at the same time because the noodles got to cool down anyway so i'm just gonna place them in here i don't even really know how many i'm going to need but i'm just going to put enough in there and let them cook down on its own i think i put like eight of them in there yeah that'll work I can put some more in there. I'm gonna turn that down. So I just do this gently when they start to fall down. I'll just do that. And I put olive oil in the water so they won't stick. Now I'm about to add in roasted garlic parmesan sauce. I'm just adding. 
And I got extra sauce just in case if I need some more. Mm-hmm. I tried to buy the big bottle, but they just didn't have it. So now what I'm going to do is lay out some Luma foil. This is going to be for where I lay my noodles on this sheet right here. You can use anything, Luma foil, wax paper, whatever. I'm just using that. Then I'm going to take my noodles, which is hot. I'm going to drain my noodles and wash them off. I hate them slimy. I don't like slimy noodles, so I don't know if you guys do it. But this is what I do. I just run water over them and clean them off. So what I wanna do here first is pour some sauce on the noodles first. So just to let y'all know, it's about to be a real serious mess here. <laughs> I'm sorry, let me put some sauce here on this surface first. So it won't be laying on a dry surface, just a little bit of that right there. You layer it like you're doing a big pan of lasagna, but you're just doing one pasta at a time. Is I take the sour cream and I lay it out here. And this is how it should look before you start rolling it up. And what you do is you take one at a time, you roll it up like this. This is where the mess kick in. This is a good one. And once I have it all looking like this, then I can add the remainder of the sauce that I have here on the top. This is delicious. You guys have to try this. Just if you don't wanna make a big pan or you're just cooking for yourself and you want some lasagna. Sometimes I make a big pan and I just freeze it. But if you don't feel like doing the whole pan, just do it like this and roll it up. And then I top it off with some cheese. Lots of cheese. I love cheese. Then you want to take your Luma foil, cover it up. And place it in the oven on 400 degrees. For about 30, 25, 30 minutes. So this looks so delicious, you guys. Quick and easy. Take a look at it. Look at that, right? And all I'm gonna do is just, instead of cutting it, just take it one by one and that's it. So I'm about to prepare the meals and I'm about to go drop the meals off i don't know if i'm gonna videotape that one or not but whatever i'm done here all right